So she has a, a situation going on here called entropion, and it's, it's a rolling in of the eyelid like this, and so the hairs that are on their face are rubbing up against her eyes all the time. Well, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. She's like, I don't want to hold still. So mm. All those hairs, you see them coming out now? Oh, look at that. Yeah. All that is supposed to be sitting right, outside, right there. There are some dogs that have this their entire life that become blind from it because literally it will scar over with black or dark brown scar tissue. So it's pretty painful to these guys. I think she's big enough that we probably could you think do it's worth mini just... entropians. The, the full procedure, basically what you do is you roll the eyelid back out and then you remove a little wedge of tissue and suture that back together so that it's actually like flipping it out all the time, getting rid of the excess tissue that's around the lower, lower eyelid. She's pretty cute, but see how she's like always like blinking little tiny bits, blinking little tiny bits. Her eyes probably always hurt her. Good girl. We have a few visitors today. We have Dr. Sean Thomas's son, Dexter Danger Thomas, and his daughter Farah. They all came today to meet the four-month-old Dalmatian known as Latte. They love the breed. They know the breed, and they are a little bit smitten. So we remove this little wedge of tissue right here. Then we're going to suture these pieces together. I love that it's a family environment here. I love that the kids get to be here for this kind of thing. It's educational. Farrah, you want to do something when you grow up and be in the veterinary world. So what a great experience for her to grow up literally having a dad right in front of her doing this medical care, doing the surgeries. I honestly, I love doing entropian surgeries because these guys come in so uncomfortable. They're so painful. She's so sweet. She's been a great dog. I had no idea you had a Dalmatian. She's almost 16 years old. Let's, we have a Dalmatian model here. We can look at her eyeballs. What do you think? Wow, that is totally different. Wow. And this is turned down a little bit. It'll settle as, it, as the swelling goes away and whatnot. We may need to readjust later, but now her hair is not going to be rubbing on her eyeballs constantly. Immediately when she wakes up, she's going to feel better. She's going to be like, what happened? She's going to be like, whoa, my eyes I feel can see. so great. All right, go ahead and turn off anesthesia. Latte was in so much discomfort when we first got her, so I'm really excited to see her open her eyes without pain for the first time in her life. What's she doing? Is she awake? Yeah, she's starting to blink a little bit earlier. Hello. Oh, hello. Oh, look eyes. at you can see her wow, eyes. Wow, you can see her eyes. <gasps> They're so bright. Oh, that's amazing. Hmm. Is that your friend? Do you want to say hi to her? She just woke up. Get a few Put minutes free. Oh. Show them your eyes. Look at your eyes. Oh my gosh, she looks like a different dog. I really love doing tasks that have immediate results, like pressure washing or mowing the lawn. And so to have a surgery, have a before and after that quick, ah, it, it's like super, super exciting. It soothes my soul. It makes my OCD feel really great. Oh, friend. <laughs> they are so cute Aww. together. She looks great. Everything went amazing here at Tannisborn Emergency Veterinary Clinic today. Good look at it. You actually look like you know what you're doing. I'm once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> Latte now gets to live a normal, happy life, pain free. Here she comes. Come on, Mayhem. Come on, Mayhem. Come on, that's what your name should be. I've had Latte for a couple of weeks now. And it's been a couple weeks of nonstop go, go, go. Traditional to the Dalmatian breed of just Spastic, crazy energy. You have the attention span of a peanut. Latte has already managed to get most of the sutures out of her left eye. Besides that, she's healing really well, she's blinking normally, and she's all in all in really great shape. My poor dogs. My dogs want to play, but they can't really play around her because she's just too rough. <laughs> yeah. This is life with a Dalmatian. <laughs> They're crazy. Root, what do you think of that Dalmatian, huh? Is she your least favorite dog we've ever rescued? Because you can't compute fast enough? Frenchies are very durable. Golden Retriever is durable. So she just needs like nice, nuggety, durable dogs that live with her. Um, and dogs that don't mind that kind of behavior. My dogs are, you know, they're gentle. They don't like that kind of behavior. <laughs> Root, are you ready? Are you ready to get your purple eyelashes out? I promise the next dog coming in, you guys are going to love. Come here, let's get your leash on. Today I'm taking Latte to see Dr. Sean Thomas to get her remaining sutures removed and have one last look. If he gives us the all clear, then there is nothing holding her back from adoption. Come on, Dalmatian. Whew. Come on. You're like all limbs, like a baby deer sm smothered in butter. 
How's she doing? She's so good. Good. <laughs> she had to All keep right. her party hat on the entire time. Yeah, so yeah, yeah you're it. missing some sutures on this side. She too. got him out on day 12, 13 oh. when I was washing her party hat. You're like 12, 13, 14. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get your sutures out, okay? All right. All right, let's see. Hopefully we don't have to sedate you for this. Girl, oh, yay, good job. Done. She's like, I really, I did all the work. She's like, but yay, <laughs> you're welcome. I she took figured out how to get you. her paw up under her e-collar to rub it. Oh. So good. I really what thought, was? I really truly yes. thought we were gonna have to sedate her for this. So good. I've been fin I've been messing <gasps> with her so much though that I think at this point oh, she's geez. just used to it. Uh -huh. How are you? So, Dr. Thomas, is she officially ready for adoption? She is very much ready for adoption. Nothing holding her back. Nope. And we have great families in mind. We do. Specifically one. Mm-hmm. All right, let's bring them in. Hi. Here they are. Hi. 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 This is so cool. It's such an honor. So Dr. Sean Thomas and his wife and his two children are officially going to be Latte's forever family. Mm -hmm. They have a Dalmatian, so they have a Dalmatian experience. They understand mm -hmm. the maniac that comes with the yes. spots. Um, and they also have a golden retriever and a Frenchie that will love to play with her. They have an English bulldog. So many things. Put her in her place. How this all happened, I, uh, after Amanda um, had brought Latte in for her eye surgery, our daughter kept asking us, can we adopt her, can we adopt oh her? Can we keep her? She's just a gorgeous dog and she's so energetic. She's, she's pretty fantastic. That doesn't happen with every dog that I see and I see hundreds of dogs a month and so, but she just, man, she really pulled at our heartstrings. This one is my rational thought when it comes to most things in life, and I've brought several animals home and been told that'll be, have a nice home someday uh, elsewhere. And um, she just texted me like three days or four days after you guys came in, and she said, when is my puppy coming home? And I assume she meant this one. When he met her, they were really interested in potentially adopting her, and I told them to go home and really talk about it, really think about it. And it's not anything personal, it's just I really need to find the right match for every animal. I've always been in love with Dalmatians, and then 15 years ago we got one, and then I was really in love with Dalmatians, yeah. not just by how cute they were, but their personalities. They don't come into rescue very often. And the fact that you brought it into me to fix, it almost seemed like it was meant to be. So, yeah, we see very few Dalmatians these days, but truly really one that was really, that needed a home. Are you excited to bring her home and yeah, have a new puppy like, in the I family? I love her personality. All the Pokemon in the world are excited. <laughs>